What's up fam? It's your boy Devin Harris, AKA I Got The Keys. Today, I'm gonna do something I haven't done in a very long time. I'm gonna make a how-to video. Today, I wanna make a review video on one of my favorite apps. It's Google Voice, really the entire Google Studio. There's so many apps they have that helps me and my business out in this real estate industry. What I wanna do today is just share the wealth I know a lot of you are probably familiar with Google Workspace. Today I'm gonna to speak specifically on Google Voice. Again, I use this almost literally every day. I can't do without it. It's a good way to save a little bit of extra money as well. I know a lot of people, especially real estate agents, they think it's cool to have two phones, all that good stuff, all that mumbo jumbo, it's all good. Me, I'm working smarter, not harder. I'm simply downloading the Google Voice app paying my $10 monthly just to have a second phone number, right? So really cool app. I wanna share my review with you guys. I'm gonna show you or walk you through how to set it up, all that good stuff. And then I'm gonna share my thoughts on the app after using it for about two years. If you like this video, go ahead and do your boy a favor, press that like button below. If you wanna see more in regards to real estate applications, or how-to videos that are closely referenced to your everyday real estate processes, please do not hesitate to hit that subscribe button below as well. I got you. All right, let's check it out. I got the keys, keys, keys. Okay, let's get started. I know a ton of you have probably already seen a lot of the videos that are currently out on YouTube regarding Google Voice walkthroughs, Google Voice reviews. Nevertheless, this is my own personal touch. Um, I know a lot of you have seen some of a few of my how-to videos. So if you like the way I go through that process step by step, then this will be yet another one that you'll love, right? Okay, let's go ahead and share my screen and let's go ahead and get started. All right, so Google Voice, this is a Google Voice, right? And let me just go ahead and hide my floating meeting controls. Boom, bam, all right, Google Voice. All you do is type in Google Voice on Google and you'll select the first link there, right? It'll bring you to this page here. This is the Google Voice welcome page. I have a couple numbers already set up, right? But for the safety of this video, I'm going to create a, an entirely new Google Voice account so that I can walk you good people through this process. It's really straightforward. And the cool thing is they even have a desktop version where it sort of correlates with the app on your phone, right? So everything that you see on the phone here, just like what you see here, you're gonna see on the desktop version. I think one of the most beneficial things, features to this app is that everything sort of um, pairs up. It's a cross functionality. So anything that you do on your computer, anything that you do on your laptop, you can also do on your phone. If someone calls you on your computer or if someone calls you your phone, um, if someone calls the assigned, assigned number that you have connected to your account, you can you can take that phone call either on your laptop or computer, or you can take it on your phone, right? I think that's probably one of the best features of this app and I love it to death, okay? All right, so let's go ahead and continue forward. I am pers I'm gonna use this for personal use, okay? I have an iOS. Um, let's see, let's, let's see what happens if, if I select iOS, it's probably going to make me download that. Yeah. Okay. So I'm going to go back and I'm going to select the computer for now. All right. So this is the setup as if you're, you're using this for the first time ever and you're doing it on your laptop, you have to select web. If you try to select iOS, then it's going to force you to, um, download the app. Okay, cool. Here, I'm just going to put my face a little bit bigger here. And we're gonna go right down here. Looking good, boy, looking good. All right, so it says, welcome to Google Voice, a free, yes, free phone number to take control of your communication, all right? By continuing, you accept the terms and service and privacy policy, right? I'm going to uh, recommend that you guys look at that on your own time. I'm gonna go ahead and continue forward and get this free number. All right, so. The next thing is asking is, oh no, what happened? Let me go back. All right, here we go. It says to select a Google voice number, look for available numbers by the city. So I am actually in Atlanta, Georgia. Okay. 
So now it's gonna populate numbers for Atlanta, Georgia, and it gives us all our numbers here, right? So um, let's see, I don't like any numbers with three sixes. So I am going to continue forward. Here we go, okay. So we got one here for uh, 404348 Let's select that bad boy. To complete the setup and start using Google Voice, you need to verify your existing number. All right, so I'm just gonna verify an existing number. Ah, man, this is bad because, I, let's see, I only have one phone number that I'm using. How am I going to do this? Hmm. 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 <clears throat> All right, so what we can do for this time being, I'm gonna use someone's phone number. I'm gonna use my girl's phone number um, and we're simply just gonna delete it and deactivate it once we complete with this setup, all right? I just wanna show you guys how, how simple this is to set this up, okay? Hey, you got that text message? Can you, what's the numbers? What's the numbers? All right, so we got it verified, there we go. So the, this phone number, basically what happened was we put in someone's phone number. So you'll put in your phone number it's going to send over a verification link for you. And then what you do at that point is simply type in the numbers that it sends you for the verification. Once you do that, it links this phone number from Google Voice up to your personal phone, right? Freaking sweet, all right? So let's continue forward. So now we're verifying, we've completed the verification. And now we have a completely brand spanking new phone number. You didn't have to go to AT&T. You didn't have to go to Sprint. You didn't have to go to Wack T-Mobile. All we simply did was sign up through Google Voice and we have a completely new line here for you to use for the free, right? Now there are paid plans. If you use the business route, there are ways that you could uh, you know, pay for a plan at which you can share the number with different associates in your organization. And it makes it a little bit more easy to work with. If you have a, a large team, let's say you, you have a team of wholesalers or an acquisitions team that you're working with, right? If you have the business, uh, if you take the business route, then there's ways for you to structure that business line and have many entities from that business line and work together collectively uh, using that number and a ton of other numbers associated with that plan. So that may be something you want to check out in the near future. Anyway, let's continue forward. All right. So next, we are now inside of Google Voice. All right. This is what it looks like on your phone as well. Okay. And I'm just going to shorten my face here. Right. Okay. So you have a number of options here. You can either make a phone call and just to test test my theory out here just to show you guys that you can literally call people from your computer i am going to call myself here and we're going to have a really quick five second conversation just to show you how well this works all right take a look at this there we go so it's finally calling let's see what happens it's so loud Look at that, I'm calling myself, it's so cool, so cool, right? All right, so those are the many, many benefits. That's one of the benefits that you get out of this, out of using this particular app, okay? You can actually call people through your phone, which is freaking amazing. You can call people, um, it really doesn't matter who you call, you can call people um, using this app. In addition, you can also text. You can text using this phone number, right? You can text using your phone or you can text using the laptop, your computer, which is freaking cool because what if you're, um, you know, you're on a flight somewhere or you just, uh, you don't have access to your phone immediately. You can use your computer instead. And that is freaking amazing, right? I am so much more productive having the text messages right here in front of me, opposed to going on my phone and doing this, right? Doing a lot of this. And this and this right so being able to go back and forth between zillow and my mls and uh google voice 
It's a tremendous benefit. Love it to death. Um, in addition, you can listen to your voicemails. You can set up voicemails on this phone. Um, there's so many benefits by doing that. Again, this is a separate line outside of your personal. So of course you can, it gives you that option to set up a voicemail here, okay? Um, in addition, you can arch of messages and it has this spam box here. I also love this, the spam box, because I do get a lot of spam through this, this Google line. Another thing that you can do on here that I love about this app is they have a spam folder here. And if you get a lot of spam messages, they are directed here instantly, right? So you don't have to play around with all these people spamming your phone. Um, they instantly go into this uh, this spam folder, which is freaking awesome. All right, so I'm just gonna go through some of the other things that they have they make available through the web version of Google Voice. Again, pretty much everything that you see here is gonna be on the phone as well, all right? All right, so they have a main menu. Let's see what it is. Actually, this is the main menu, right? These are all our menu options. It is making it, it, it is, you're just able to extend it so you can see the words. Um, over here, let's see, you have your audio settings. So you can use different microphones. You can use a different ringer. It, de it definitely does ring whenever, whenever you, um, whenever you receive a phone call, it does have a ring whenever you do get phone calls coming in, which is freaking cool. You can even choose different speakers if you wanted to, okay? Um, they also have a settings option here. Um, you know, you can delete your number, unlock it. It shows you the devi devices that it's hooked up to, your link numbers. You can even add multiple lines here, which is, again, this is a huge benefit, guys. There's so many beneficial things you can do with Google Voice. I am telling you, you have to try this out, all right? You can port numbers to Google Voice. And again, um, porting numbers is basically you transferring numbers from your carrier to Google Voice. This allows you to use all of the Google Voice's features with the number of people already used to call you. So that's also yet another benefit that you can um, have using this, this application. Um, or you can, um, let's say you get tired or rather you, you don't, you no longer need this particular account. You can simply transfer your number to another one. Um, you can forward your, 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 your messages to your email, which is sort of repetitive. I actually disable that option personally because this, why get it to your emails if you're getting it through the Google Voice app as well. Some people may like this. Some people may think it's beneficial. So, hey, don't mean, um, you know, you know if, that, if that works out for you, cool. Go ahead and have them sent to your, uh, to your, your email as well. Anyway, there's a long list of settings here that you can sort of play around with the Google Voice. You have a do not disturb. Um, you can screen calls, get email alerts, call forwarding. Um, you can you can choose what it does when, um, let's see, it says show, show my Google Voice number as a caller ID when forwarding calls. So whenever you forward calls, it, it, you can choose to have your Google Voice number being shown to post your own. Um, let's see the other options here. Oh, yep, so you can record your voicemail right on your web, your PC, your laptop. Didn't know that, all right? Your voicemails are also transcribed. So let's say you can't listen to someone's voicemail. You can literally just hear them talk it out or they, it'll write, write it down in text the best as possible, okay? Um, let's see, call to listen, check and manage your voicemails by calling Google Voice number. That is also another cool tactic there. A lot of you, a lot of you people in corporate offices, you use this with your office phone, you call your number to uh, just listen to your voicemails. That's also yet another beneficial um, tag or benefit you can use using Google Voice in the event you want to do that. Okay. Um, payment. So you also that you know obviously if you choose a select select payment plans or options for Google Voice, um, your billing history will be here um, in the event you do take the option where it requires you to to pay for something. You can filter your spam change the accessibility, change the high contrast colors, all this good stuff is you'll find in your settings tab with Google Voice, okay? So I'm just gonna exit out of settings and go back to our main screen here. Um, and that's it, guys. This is all that, that you will find on Google Voice app. So I basically just walked you through how to set up your very own Google Voice number, doing so by simply going through the Google, uh, uh, google.com or rather Google Voice dot com voice.google.com rather 
and basically all you're doing is going through each step just just like i just walked you through here in this video it's as straightforward as that you sign up for google voice you select your phone number you send over a confirmation number to your your carrier yourself your cell phone you confirm that it's you and that's it you have a your very own free phone number to use for whatever you want right even better, you can go in when you're tired of using it, you can go in and simply delete it. Just like how I'm gonna show you now, watch this. Boom, it's done. I don't want this anymore. We're gonna delete that number. We are now completely out of Google Voice. I don't have anything linked to this account now, right? So I'm just gonna sign up and boom, that's done. Just like that. All right, so guys, again, um, everything that you've seen there, you can literally do on your phone as well. I think it is extremely beneficial. This is an extremely beneficial app that you can utilize. Uh, regardless of the business that you're in, me personally, I'm in real estate, and I think it is such a huge benefit being able to have a second line on this phone um, outside of my personal number. I don't have to go waste money, um, waste a large monthly fee on an additional phone from AT&T, knowing I have Google Voice, and I can simply connect that number to this phone here, right? Cool guys. Hey, I hope you guys enjoyed that information. All right, guys, super, super excited. I was able to share that information with you. I really do hope you eventually try this app out for yourselves. I know a lot of people have different opinions on these uh, these new apps that we have released nowadays. So some of you may like it, some, may, some of you may not like it. It's all good. I'm here to share the wealth anyway. Anyway, guys, if you like the video again, please do your boy a favor, hit that like button below, share the video with your friends and fam. Um, if you hate the video, still like it for me, just so I can get the more views and helping me out tremendously. And of course, if you want more informative videos, just like this one that I just gave you today, please do not hesitate to subscribe to my channel. I got you guys. All right, I'll see you on the next episode. I got the keys, keys, keys.